What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Shantia, and I'm back with another banger, another word, okay? Now, listen, y'all, I got a word for y'all today, and the title of this video is called Twice the Blessing, okay? Twice the Blessing. What does that mean? This is a season of double portion, okay? This is a season of double portion. Now, listen, y'all. As I'm literally on my way to come make this video, there were two signs bold as day that God showed me within a three minute drive, okay? And so the first sign that I saw as I pulled out was that somebody's license plate said obedience on it, okay? That was sign number one. A minute later, as I'm turning into the parking lot, there's this huge Dunkin' Donuts truck and on the back of the truck, somebody had wrote, you know, in the dirt on the truck, um... They wrote Jesus and then they wrote repent and they wrote ten, uh, Romans 10 verse 9, okay? And Romans 10 verse 9 says, if you declare with your mouth, Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved, okay? And so listen, God put an emphasis on this video to make sure, okay, that I delivered this message to you all to let you know that in order for you to even receive your double portion or your abundance, okay, that comes with A, that comes through obedience, and that also comes through through repentance okay um and the last one that it comes through is deliverance okay but the first two signs was obedience repentance and then it's deliverance for you to officially receive your double portion and so as he was talking to me um about this and the importance of how these two are very important before receiving you know your blessing of course the scripture there were two words <coughs> two scriptures that he led me to and um it was Zechariah 9 12 which said return to your fortress which basically means return back to God okay you prisoners of, of hope to be a prisoner of hope is to be somebody okay that is clinging on to hope through their trust in God okay and so return back to your fortress you prisoners of hope even now I announce that I will restore twice as much to you okay twice as much to you so that was the scripture that um he led me to but <laughs> before we even get into that scripture um or even the word of double portion and receiving your double portion the dream y'all that i had last night was so prophetic okay and as i woke up the holy spirit was speaking about how there are a lot of people that are in this season okay so pay attention so in the dream, I immediately entered into um, this place, okay? And there was this man. You can tell that he was a enemy, right? He was a demonic force. And then there was, like, his workers or whatever the case was. And as we're in there, though, it's me. It's my household, okay? And there was one extra person. I don't remember the extra person. Maybe it was the Holy Spirit, okay? And so it's my household and um, another family member. And so... It's my household. We're in there and, you know, he starts saying certain stuff. And I was like, no, me and my family getting up out of here. And those are my exact words. And so in that moment, you know, he couldn't do anything. He couldn't stop us. He couldn't do none of that. Okay. He just um, heard what exactly what it is that I spoke. And so I literally grabbed, you know, me and my family, all the belongings. And I'm like, come on, let's go. And in that moment, this particular family member was dwelling in this camp, okay, which is confirmation to the season that they've entered of how their rebellion, you know, against God and turned their back on God, okay? And so they were dwelling in a camp, and I was like, I don't have time. Like, you know, I was like, I gotta go. Like, you know, I'm gonna have to come back to get the family member later. So in that moment, the man, um, you know, I told him because he looked at me and he started laughing. And I was like, um, please don't put that particular family member, you know, like in your dungeon or whatever this like lower place was. And he laughed and he was like, oh, but I am. And so in that moment, right in front of his face, I got down on my knees and I prayed. Okay. And I'm praying to the Holy Spirit and I am declaring, okay, that he will not, you know, hold them captive. I am declaring, asking God for grace and mercy, asking God for protection, despite this family member being disobedient and turning their back, you know, on God. And so immediately after I got done praying, 
I ended up leaving, okay? And the dream ended. And so all in all, the Holy Spirit was speaking to me, you know, just about that, A, being delivered, okay? Being in a season of deliverance. And so that was my household, right? We had already been delivered, completely being set free, okay? And so, um, but in this moment, I was trying to deliver you know, the family member, but of course it wasn't time yet, but that did not stop me from praying on their behalf because I refused to leave them, you know, where they are. And so I say all this to say that that is a lot of you in this season, whether it is you interceding, okay, on your behalf for your, um, your friends on your, your friends and your family, or B, if it is actually you, okay, that have turned your back on God, and you are now just in the enemy's camp playing in his territory, okay, wherever you fit at. But I say all this to say that the part of me praying, like it shows the power of prayer, okay, the power of obedience, the sign that God showed me, and also the power of repentance, okay, of turning back to God. Those three things right there is what is going to unlock your double portion, now, we're going to go Bible, okay? Because yes, there is Job, Job 42, that literally talks about it. Job 42.10 says, after Job had prayed for his friends, interceding, okay? After Job had prayed for his friends, the Lord restored his fortunes and gave him twice as much as he had before, okay? This right here, it just shows God's faithfulness and blessing Job with a double portion after his seasons of trials. And so listen, I don't know who you are, but baby, it's your time, okay, where you will receive your double portion. This is your time where you will receive twice the blessing, okay? And so I need you to be expectant, to be expecting these miracles. Okay, twice the blessing every single day that you wake up. You're not you're going to see double There's going to be double miracles. There's going to be double blessings. Okay, so I need you to expect it I need you to look for it I need you to anticipate it because God is saying from here on out you have now entered into a season of Double portion because of your obedience because of your repentance and also because of your deliverance because you have been Interceding on behalf of your family and your friends God said because you have done that it has set you free it has delivered you and it had ushered you into a season of abundance this is your season of abundance where you are going to see a double portion for all of the trials for all of the setbacks for all of the things that took place for all of the times that the enemy tried to keep you in captivity listen god is saying you are no longer in that season the enemy can no longer touch you he can no longer do what he may please god said all of that that was a test of your faith. It was a test that had come upon you to see, will you still serve me in the midst of this trial? Will you still serve me in the midst of, of this setback? Will you still serve me in the midst of things coming against you? God wanted to test you to make sure that your heart was in the right posture. And because you passed the test, and you still decided to pray on behalf of your family and your friends. God said it has ushered you into a season of double portion. God is not the God that wants to give you back what you had before. God wants to give you exceedingly abundantly and above. More than you can think or ask for. And a lot of the times the stuff that we're praying for is really us settling. We have no idea the things that God wants to unlock and give us in our season of double portion. Okay? And so listen, like I always say, this is a prophetic word, okay? You will know if this word is for you. If you have not been in the season of obedience or repentance, listen, this is your time to repent, okay? And to start being obedient so that in your next season, you can step into the season of double portion. And then there's other you, others of you who have been obedient and have repented and have interceded from your family members. And this word is for you to let you know that you have entered into a season of double portion. Be expected from today moving forward be expecting for your double portion for your double blessings for your double miracles god said you are going to see them with your own eyes okay and so listen i pray that you all can receive this blessed and prosperous word please make sure you like comment subscribe and share this video out to 10 of your family and your friends someone who needs to hear this word i love you all so much and i will see you all next time bye